Reliance Controls presents, What the Heck is That? I'm Chris. I'm Maya. And, and we're, we're from, from Reliance. Reliance. In this episode, transfer switches. Check out this picture of a portable generator. They're handy little machines that homeowners buy for when they lose power. Isn't it true that generators were never actually designed for home backup power? That's exactly right. I mean, most generators were designed to provide power to construction sites, outdoor applications, places where the utility power is typically not present. And with 7,500 watts of power, what people don't realize is that most don't even use that much when backing up their home. Exactly. I mean, many people are only using about a quarter of the power that their generator produces because they're using extension cords to run through open doors or windows and connecting to the generator's 15 amp outlet. So to solve that issue of inefficiency is actually where the transfer switch comes into play. Absolutely. What they really need to do is use this 30 amp outlet and then they'll get that full power out of the generator. I mean, you can plug into a transfer switch and run multiple circuits in your home versus running a few extension cords through open doors or windows. So using a transfer switch means that I can run my fridge, my laptop, my AC, and my espresso machine. Absolutely. Which is great because mama needs her coffee. Oh, I would die without my coffee. So how many cups a day? Okay, well, because it's so bold and complex. I have to cap it at two. You don't want to go overboard with this stuff. It's a good number. Yeah. And I mean, I think doctors recommend two cups a day or something Sounds along like it those lines. Could be Maybe. a real fact. All jokes aside, Chris, I think we're forgetting to mention a really important piece to operating a portable generator. Running extension cords through open doors or windows is never a good idea. Generators produce a ton of carbon monoxide and you could die. And that's the dirty little secret about portable generators. And unfortunately, what most people don't know is that many portable generators don't have emissions controls on them. So the output of carbon monoxide is like that of an old Studebaker. All right, we've thrown a lot at you and it's a lot to process, making it all come together from generator to house. So there is specific products and steps. Yeah, that's absolutely right. And we want you guys to be up to date on everything you need to know about transfer switches and generators. Check out some of our installation videos and make sure you hit that subscribe button. Yeah, we'll catch you next time on Reliance Presents. What, what the, the heck, heck is, is that? that? Reliance Controls, electrical innovation since 1909.